Hello everyone, this is 76 Hot Rod F250, aka the Nerdy Redneck, and I'm changing things up a little bit today, and I want to show y'all my 1985 Lawn Garden Catalog from Montgomery Ward. I bought this off eBay uh, about a, two weeks ago, paid like 12 something, some change, free shipping, so under $13. Um, some of the other sellers had this for like almost a hundred and no. Uh, I tried to find an 83, that's my birth year, but I, I saw this in for a reasonable price and I had to have it. So I just kind of want to make a little video and just kind of show everything that's in this catalog. It's lawn and garden, but the old catalogs, the 60s, 70s, they called it, um, lawn and farm or farm and garden. Um, there's the back of it. It has literally everything in here that you could have gotten for your outdoor needs. Your your garden, your farm, um, your backyard, what have you. There are color photos and there's a lot of black and white photos. But the main thing I really liked was these old pictures of the lawn tractors and push mowers. I mean, there's chainsaws and everything in here too. And lo and behold, on the very first pages, in color... <gasps> Brand new 1985 Montgomery Ward, built by MTD. These are the MTD style tractors. Oh, this thing of beauty. Look at that. It's gorgeous. And there's all the little rundown of all the parts, the decks, engines, Briggs and Stratton motors right there. Mower decks, transaxles. Thought it was pretty dang cool. Special sale! Oh boy! Lowest price of the year! <laughs> yeah, yeah. $300 less through June 30th. 11 horse lawn tractor. Won't be priced lower this year than $1,000. Look at these prices! I didn't know these tractors were this expensive back in the 80s. I thought, you know, they would be a little cheaper. There's the beast right there, the garden tractor. Got the wheel weights. Looks like some kind of a... Uh, I'm not familiar with all of those. Uh, some, let's see. Litter B. Let's see here. I'm trying to get this on camera here. $400 power takeoff tiller. I don't look okay. I guess that's a tiller. I guess it's it's PTO. That's why I couldn't tell. Um, God, that thing's awesome. Look at those. Look at that. Oh, thing of beauty. Hydrostatic drive. Now, some of you guys on my channel, uh, the older subscribers, may remember I have a basically the same tractor, but I have the MTD actual branded version with the different front end. It's a hydrostatic, 18 horse. Metallic finish is tough, durable, and rust resistant. Sleeve hitch. Yep, I got those. Team horse, Briggs and Stratton. Hydrostatic transaxle. Heavy gardening. This is the tractor. Look at that. Yeah. Awesome. Look at those prices. Anyway, I wanted to show you all the lawn tractors specifically. And there's. Remember my little red MTD I had a couple of years ago? This is basically the same tractor as this one. This is just the Montgomery Ward branded version. That thing was slow as heck. There's another shot of one. See, mine had, mine had these little side covers like this. But it had more of this style front end there. There's the trailers. Trailers are $120 back then. They're still that same price. It's insane. A lot of these prices have pretty much hadn't really changed much with inflation and everything. I love these color photos, though. There's for a long back for your tractor. All the different uh, attachments. It's pretty cool. Lawn sweepers. It's got, every, it's got a little of everything. 
big old tires and tractor weights. Snow throwers. I don't have these here in my state of Texas. I've never seen a snow thrower ever in person. Had one of these once though um, for a craftsman, I think, and then we modified it for the old John Deere Saber many years ago. These are cool. I'd love to make one of these. Oh. And it starts getting into the black and white photos, but it's pretty cool. All the neat stuff that's in here. Disc plows and cultivators, aerators. And then it just gets into other things like stuff for your garage and other stuff. You got these heaters there. There's some push mowers. I always wanted one of these. Those are so cool. and Stratton powered Montgomery Ward push mowers. Awesome. Actually, I've got a mower in my backyard. It's got that kind of control. More color photos of mowers. Look at this electric one. Isn't that crazy looking? Side discharge, three and a half horse. Two hundred thirty-nine ninety-nine. Self-propelled. <laughs> it's pretty cool. This one's a self-propelled. It's got the rear drive. I've actually got one of these. Just doesn't have. It's got the the little rainbow graphics right here instead. Instead of the physical badge. It's a little bit newer model. Tons more push mowers, mower accessories, parts. Lots of parts. Wheels, tires, blades, belts. There's edgers, tillers, big tillers. Pretty cool. Log splitters. It's pretty awesome. I'm not into splitting logs. I have no need for one, but I find them pretty cool. Some chainsaws. McCulloch's. Eager Beaver. Huh. I just now realized that. Never heard of that one. All McCulloch's pre-season sale. Better get on it right now. <laughs> Fall's coming up. I just got some cool axes in here. There's just all kinds of neat stuff. All these uh, trimmers, weed whackers, whatever you want to call them. It's got a saw blade on it. And so does that one. Some of the electric ones. I think. When I was growing up with my parents, I think they had one of these. I'm not sure. I've seen these before, too. They're really goofy. And this one, I think my parents actually had one of those. They're really stupid. <laughs> Another for shovels and rakes. Look at this guy. He looks very enthusiastic. Digging that pothole. <laughs> oh, jeez. Portable sprayers. Look at this. Fuck. Like, so happy to do that. This catalog is really thick. I mean, there's all kinds of pages. I this is. I mean, I never really went through the whole thing. I just kind of skimmed through it and looked some some of the. Um, Tractor pictures, stuff for your farm, see? Chickens and everything, old chicken coop stuff, feeders. Yeah, this thing's got everything in it. There's a credit card application. Too bad Montgomery Rewards is gone now. It's a darn shame. That was probably my favorite version of the logo with the uh, maroon stripe underneath.
That's the, that's the version I remember growing up in the late 80s and 90s. Early 90s, I should I say. My dad worked there, Montgomery Ward, in the automotive department. So going to Montgomery Ward's when I was a kid was a pretty special thing. And it was in the mall near my hometown, the beekeeper guy. And um, right outside of Montgomery Ward in the mall was a Chick-fil-A, so yeah, I always went to Chick-fil-A after that and got my uh, waffle fries or my ice cream. It was pretty cool back in the back in the day. I was just fencing. And it was just kind of a little bit more boring towards the end. Like you just get like like I mean, you know, fence, fence, pens, animal stuff. There's some garden sheds. Look at that's cool. Driving that Montgomery Ward tractor out of there. Look at his face. Looks kind of like a um, cross between Dale Earnhardt and uh, Bob Vila. And some creepy guy that might sell you pancakes at IHOP. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I just love taking out the trash. Me. Huh, can I borrow this uh, chair? Well, maybe, if you bring it back in one piece. No, I don't think I'm going to borrow now. <laughs> oh, I don't like making snarky comments. I sure do like my new bicycle in my shed. Meh. Looks like uh, generators. Look, look at these freaking generators. Those are cool. What we got here? More generators. I'll check this out. That old RV. Too bad it ain't in color. Colic portable alternator. Perfect for camping, boating, outdoors. Only $399.99. No money down. <laughs> Watch TV. Go anywhere. Oh, jeez. Classic stuff. There's some cement mixers. Boy, I hope, hope sure no one puts their fingers in my freshly poured concrete. Doo -doo -doo. Flowers. Hey, a butter churn? Is that a butter churn? Hang on. F. Oh, it's for making juice. Oh, okay, it's a fruit grinder. I mean, it shows apples, but it looked kind of like a butter churn. So I wasn't sure. That's pretty cool. Sundials. Lawn sprinklers. <sighs> These flowers are so boring. Pretty much gone through this whole thing. There's some dollies. Oh, yeah. Growing up, we had one of these dollies. They're orange and black. And I even found one myself later on in my teen years. Still got both of them, but they're both in terrible condition. Thought that was pretty cool that those were in here. And my mom had one of these, but it it rotted out real bad. It sat outside, and we we scrapped it back over 20 years ago. And I think my mom has one of these still. Pretty much, all, like, most of what we had growing up came from Montgomery Ward. My dad worked there, so he got deals on stuff. Rolling trash cans. Look at those wheels. It's pretty cool. Like, it's got mag wheels on it. Some lights. Outdoor lighting. Barbecue grills. Real fancy ones. And... Pretty much about it, and it's just grills, more grills, lawn, or lawn benches, park benches, lawn chairs. Yeah, pretty cool. Anyway, that's pretty much it. Um, hope you enjoyed uh, looking at that as much as I did buying it and looking at it. Um, so anyway. Um, Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And um, 
as usual, just stay tuned for more videos. I produce all kinds of random videos nowadays. Um, my mind just goes off to different tangents and I do different things. This being one of them. And uh, that's pretty much it. So thanks for watching. Stay tuned and I'll be seeing you later.